fourth day in Athens, we are heading to rent a car and go to see some beaches. Step four. Everybody just do your thing. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. 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 We just rented the car and um, are heading to the beach Clifada and then we'll be going to the temple of Poseidon. If I'm not mistaken, I'll go there, check and then uh, be more correct. Set your affirmations, aspirations. I got shit to do the aftermath of preparation. Good food, good mood, blood in circulation. One step at a time, yeah, that's how you make it. We've paid 69 euros for the car, and then they also require 100 euros as a deposit or 800 euros as a deposit if you're not doing an insurance. Um, so we did an insurance and had like 100 euros as a deposit. Kalifada Beach is found in front of the famous coastal settlement where many Athenians visit during the summer season. It is located 16 kilometers south of the city of Athens. In Glyfada, you will not find typical beaches, but you will surely enjoy a refreshing swim and a relaxing sand bath. The area is filled with trendy cafes, lively bars, cozy restaurants of all types. Most of the beaches in Glyfada are public, but you may find some private beaches as well, uh, which have an entry fee. The area is easily accessed by many local buses from the city center. Yeah, so I'ma fake it till I make it Positive thoughts are overtaken I got patience One day at a time is how you operate a cadence A flow, you grow, you show yourself a foundation Stay away from all the shit that causes temptation I know that I like to do it cause of sensation I live my life in my head like a narration Don't expect greatness, do my best, man, I'll take it Wake up, today's gonna be a good day Wake up, today's gonna be a good day to another beach Although Athens is famous mainly for its sightseeing, there are many beautiful beaches to explore. The beaches of Athens are spread all along the southern and northeastern sides of the Attica Peninsula. Many of the beaches are accessible by bus, but for ease and peace of mind, renting a car would be a great option. It's super hot and we need to go up there. Oh, I didn't like this. And bought the tickets. It's 10 euros per ticket. And there's a very beautiful view from there. And we are climbing up to somewhere over there.
it appears to be not that far like 10 minutes, 5 minutes of walk but the beauty from here the view from here it's absolutely worth it The Temple of Poseidon is an ancient Greek temple dedicated to the god Poseidon. Built in the 5th century BC, the temple is in the typical Greek hexa style. The whole temple is constructed through a white marble. The Temple of Poseidon is one of the most majestic temples in the whole of Greece. It is about 70 kilometers out of central Athens. The Greeks considered Poseidon to be the master of the sea. Poseidon was of a particular relevance and value to the Athenians. The temple is located approximately 200 meters above sea level on the edge of a rocky cliff offering stunning views of the Aegean Sea during sunset. The temple originally had 38 Doric columns of which 16 are standing today. Four of these columns were re-erected during the 20th century. Porto Rafti is one of the most beautiful coastal settlements in Attica, located 35 kilometers southeast of the city center. The beach gets very popular in summer due to the numerous visitors taking a short break from the daily routine. The beach is well protected from the strong winds due to the two rocky islands that block them. The surrounding area offers plenty of night bars, cafes and excellent taverns.